Hi guys, it's Gilbert from Clubly, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a, a paper origami crane. So first things first, we're going to need paper lined or copy paper, it doesn't really matter, but today I'm going to be using copy paper. Scissors, I'm only going to use them once. And these markers, I'm going to use them to emphasize and reference my crease lines. So first things first, we're going to create a nice square. So we're going to take this and put them edge to edge, making sure they're nice and parallel with each other. Now you're just going to fold once you get them nice and straight with each other. Okay, now you're going to cut off this little piece. Now you're going to cut off this little rectangle right here. This is the only time you guys are going to be using the scissors today. So now once you guys have it cut, I'm going to go ahead and mark this line for you guys because we're actually going to be needing it today. And I'm going to be using the red marker. Now we're going to take these two corners and put them together with each other. Okay, now that I have it like this, I'm going to go ahead and mark my line again for you guys. Whoops, it's okay. I'm going to still mark it for you guys so you guys can still at least see that line. So now I'm going to go ahead and flip my paper over and I'm going to fold it into two, into one, into rectangles. So this is going to be my first rectangle. And now my second, I'm going to... I'm actually going to mark this line first, so I'm going to mark it in purple for you guys. And now I'm going to go ahead and fold it again, but going this way this time, guys. So I'm going to go ahead and mark this line again for you guys. Okay, now that I have it facing me like this, now what I want to do is make one corner face me. This corner is facing me right here. But to show you guys how to do this, I'm actually going to do it facing you so you guys can see how you can do it. So look, what all I'm going to do is just fold it onto these two purple lines right here where my fingers are, where my index fingers are, right here. Now I'm just going to fold it down, fold, 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 and it should just all go naturally, guys. The only part is you might have to force this piece right here. And you're just going to force it down, making yourself a nice little square like so. Okay, so now that you have it like this, now you're going to make sure that these two little flappy things right here are facing you, okay? And I'm going to do everything facing you guys, okay? So look, now I'm just going to take this edge right here and go ahead and fold it onto this red line. But you're going to be doing all of this while facing you, making sure that these flaps are facing you. The only reason why I'm doing it like this right now is so you guys can see, okay? So now I'm going to go ahead and fold, fold, fold. Now I'm going to go ahead and flip it over and fold it to this red line right here, like so. Like that. And I'll go ahead and do it to the same thing on this side. Okay. Now you're going to go ahead and unfold it. And now that you guys have it, actually, you're going to, I'm sorry, I forgot to tell you guys this, but now that you guys have it like this, nice and folded, you're just going to fold this little top down towards you, and then you're going to fold it back up. This is just for later on use, for right now, actually. So now that we have it like this, making sure that these two little flappy things are still facing you, you're going to go ahead and open it up like this, and just make it cave in on itself like so. These, these two bottom ones should go a little smoothly, and these two top ones are going to take a little time to go ahead and fold. So just be patient with it, guys. Just be patient. So now that I have it folded like this, I'm going to do the same thing on the other side, guys. The same exact thing on the other side. So just go ahead and open it up. Fold it up like so.
Like I said, just be patient with you guys. It'll come. There we go. Okay. Now that you guys have it nice and folded like this, you're going to make sure that these two little flappies are facing you. So what you're going to do is you're going to take this corner and put it towards the middle. And I'm going to show you what I mean right now after I finish this little folder here. Okay. So now you're going to take this little flappy and put it like that. Bang, like that. Making sure it's on the flappy side, guys. And you do this on both sides of the paper, guys. So fold it like so. Okay. Now you're going to go ahead and do the same thing on the other side. Like this. Bam, like that. Whoops. I messed up a little bit, but it's okay. And just fix it really quick. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and do this side. Okay, now that I have it like this, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and open it like this and just pinch these two together. I'm going to go ahead and fold it down like this. Like this, guys. I'm going to go ahead and make sure it's nice and folded down like this, guys. Now that you guys have it like this, there's going to be a little crease right here. I don't know if you guys can see it. It's on both sides right there. I don't know if you guys can see it, but all you guys are going to do is just fold it up like so. On both sides, guys. And then now what you're going to do, you're going to do the same exact thing. You're going to go ahead and open it up like this. Now what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and fold these two flappies down, creating your crane. Your wings for your crate, I'm sorry. Okay, now that you guys have both of your wings folded, now you guys are gonna take these two, or you can do one at a time. You're gonna take it and line it up with this line right here, this line right here, the one that my left index finger is touching, or right for you guys. So go ahead and fold it down, and then just go ahead and pinch it right here. Now I'm going to do the same thing to the other side. Just fold it down to the same line, guys. Or not the same line, but the same opposite line. And now to create the head of the crane, I'm going to go ahead and just pinch like this and just pinch it down like so. I'm just going to pinch it right there, and that's going to create your head. And there you guys go. Now you guys got your crane. Practice is key, guys. You guys got this. Just be patient with it. Miss you guys. Club Lee.